Hey, it's Lindsay and welcome to my YouTube channel. I just want to welcome you here. I am a homeschool mama of four years and today I'm going to be giving you my honest opinion and review of Bob Jones math, especially particularly the third grade year. So welcome, grab a cup of coffee and join me for this review video. So today I'm going to be reviewing Bob Jones or BJU math, particularly the fourth edition. Um, and so I have the curriculum kit here in front of me. Um, we have used Bob Jones math for three different grade levels. Um, and how it came about and how I use this program, I've used many different math programs and at some point I'll make a video of all those different programs. But the reason we came to this program is because we are a very mathematical family. My husband and I are both um, very smart and very um, mathematically minded. And so our children are that way. Um, both of our children are very smart and gifted in math. Both of our children are actually, they were both very reluctant and slow to read. But when it came to math, my problem as a homeschool mama was that I did not know how to break math down to my child's level, to teach them the basics and to break it to their level. And so our first couple years of homeschooling, I really struggled to teach it at their level. And so when we entered second grade, I really, really struggled. And a friend suggested, and after looking at a lot of YouTube videos, I stumbled upon Bob Jones. It was very rigorous, I noticed, and it was advanced, but it also had a great and colorful teacher guide. So what we were looking for was something colorful, something rigorous for my gifted children, and something that was going to hold their attention, something that was going to challenge them. And so my son was coming um, into second grade, and so there was Bob Jones. And so that's Kind of how we found that. So what I love is that the teacher's guide is scripted. Um, it tells you everything you need to say and I can show you this. Um, I can flip it around the camera around but it tells you all the materials you need. It tells you how to break it down. It tells you how to teach your child um, and then it shows you their work pages and it shows you how to work everything out um, and to break it to their level. And so I will tell you that Bob Jones does introduce concepts at an earlier age than other curriculum. So for some people, they don't like that. But for us, it's been great. And it's been a good, um, enough of a challenge, but not too much. Um, and so in the curriculum kit, which I've always bought because it's always ended up being a cheaper and you do get a lot of things, which we've not always used everything. You do get the teacher guide. My one caveat and the one thing I don't like about the teacher guide is sometimes as you get into the older guides, it requires material or it wants you to use materials that don't always come. It comes in like a teacher kit um, that you need to pay extra for that I don't always do. I don't pay extra for. Um, it comes with a colorful work text, which I'll turn my camera around in a minute and show you. Um, my son has thoroughly used this and loved it. So we love the colors. Um, some of this you may notice is not worked in because he skipped because he, we, um, if he knows it and he knows what to do, we skip it. So BJU, Bob Jones, is a mastery approach to math, which we also prefer. We do spiral means that you do a concept, you may do another concept and you spiral back around and and do it. Mastery means you're going to do the same concept till your child, child masters it, then you're going to move on to another subject. But what I do love about Bob Jones is at the end of a subject, you're gonna have this small review. And at the in all of the different reviews are gonna have different things. Um, and so they're not gonna always be the same review. And at the end of each section, you're gonna have a um a chapter two review. At the end of each chapter, you're gonna have a review, which to me is sufficient. Um, and we've not had any issues. My child's retained everything, it's been great. Um, but in case your child is struggling with retaining it, each curriculum kit comes with a review and a review answer key in case your child needs more, um, more, um, practice and more, you know, review for those concepts. And it also comes with test, which we don't use. And then each curriculum kit also comes with manipulatives, which we don't use either. Um, this is all manipulatives. We use these a lot in second grade, um, but I have not 
use these this year. I bought a lot of um, different curriculums. I'm sorry, not curriculums. I bought a lot of manipulatives um, at the beginning of the year, which I can make another video about that are super helpful that we have loved this year um, that I got from Rainbow Resource that we have used throughout this year to where these paper ones just haven't been needed. And um, so I do like these. Again, in second grade, we use them a ton. We haven't needed them as much. I do think these fractions, we did just look at these um, when we were learning fractions, these were helpful, but I didn't really tear them out and use them. Um, but I think with learning fractions, these were great. So I hope this is helpful for Bob Jones. Again, to me, just to recap, I think it's a rigorous program. I think it is a very well-rounded program. I think that it is definitely, um, it de oh, it is a biblical program. So there will be mentions of God in there. And so if that's a problem for you, just know that. It's definitely not a problem for us. Um, we are definitely a Christian homeschool um, but it definitely um, is well-rounded. It's definitely rigorous, um, but don't let that scare you. It definitely is mastery, um, but it does have a small built-in review, um, and it's definitely advanced. It definitely each year introduces topics um, before other programs do, and so that's also to note. So if that's something that would bother you, you can either skip it or you may just wanna make sure you wanna look at that table of contents. And so if you look um, on the website, you can always just scroll to that table of contents just to see what they're gonna be learning um, because each table of contents is gonna show you what that child is learning. But I will tell you at the very end of this guide, um, they were learning some pretty advanced stuff for fourth, for third grade. Um, so like we were doing long division with remainders. Um, but what I love, this is another thing, there's mental math, which I'm very um, big that children need to know mental math because once they learn just by the book, you can't reteach mental math, but if they know mental math, it's been proven that they can always show their work. And so I'm very big on mental math. So anyways, I really am a big supporter of BJU. I do think there are other great programs as well, but BJU is what's worked for our family. I hope this is helpful. Let me know your favorite math curriculums. Let me know if you like BJU. Um, again, if you have any questions, let me know, and I hope this video is helpful. Have a great day.